What's up guys, it's Eric from Rare King, and today we're back with another opening video for you guys. Uh, I saw some new product over there at Walmart. I shouldn't say new, I think he's been out for a couple weeks now, but I saw these blister packs and I was like, you know what? I don't have these yet, I'm gonna pick these up and do a little opening for everybody. So, here we are. Just when you thought our Steam Siege openings were over, you were wrong. We got some more. So yeah, each of these are a blister pack. This one's the single one, comes with one pack and a promo, and these come with three packs and a promo. So we have, let's see here, we have Lucario, Rayquaza, and Azelf. So I think I'm gonna save Rayquaza for last because, you know, Rayquaza's cool. So I'm just gonna sit that guy back there and let's just start with the single pack for Lucario. So. Really not sure what I'm looking for out of these packs, to be honest. <laughs> uh, I think I have most of the stuff I need, but nevertheless, definitely trying to pull something good if we are able to. And oh god, I got to be careful here. I feel like they make these promos like impossible to get out of these plastic containers. Oh, maybe I'll actually do this one. Cool. I feel like half the time it's really easy to damage these things if you want to, or even if you don't want to, I should say. So here we have this nifty Lucario promo. Definitely love the artwork on this thing, it looks awesome. Uh, let's see what this guy does. 100 hit points, slightly annoying because you can't search it with level ball, but uh, it's got bone rush for a fighting, flip until you get tails, 30 times the number of heads. So pretty bad attack, I'm sorry. 50% uh, chance you won't even do damage for the turn, I don't like that. And then Mock Claw. This tax damage isn't affected by resistance, so 90 for 3 energy. Eh, not the worst thing since there's strong energy out there, but I don't know. I don't see it being used really. But nevertheless, it definitely looks very nice, so can't complain too much. And of course, like I said, comes with one pack of Steam Siege. So let's see what we can get. Maybe we can grab ourselves like a Full Art Sycamore or... Maybe like a uh, Volcanian EX. As long as it's not Steelix EX, I will be okay. Because if you guys haven't seen our videos trashing on Steelix by now, just know that we are not a fan of Steelix here at Rare Candy. <laughs> or at least not the card from Steam Siege. But here we have Krogunk, Mareep, Litwick, Hoppip, Meowth, Steel Spirit Link, uh oh, hope that's not a bad sign. <laughs> uh, Clang, Special Charge, good card. Reverse Hollow Spirit Tomb, which is a rare, so that's, that counts for something, I guess. And a rare Armaldo, so nothing spectacular there at all, but we did get a rare reverse at the very least. So next up, we'll try the Azelf Blister Pack. I gotta say, I'm pretty excited we have an Azelf promo. Like, I think the last, uh, I'm trying to think, the last of the legendary trio or legendary sprites or whatever these guys are called, psychic trio. I think the last time we got them was in Legends Awakened, if I remember right. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but it's been forever since we've had these cards uh, or the, have these Pokemon in the TCG. So let's see what our, our buddy Azelf here does. So definitely cool art as usual with a lot of these promos. Uh, it's got the attack, Shining Eyes, put two damage counters on each of your opponent's Pokemon that has any damage counters on it. So uh, that's interesting. Uh, I don't know how good it is. Maybe if like Eradicate Break becomes a thing, you can play like one of this card. If you, as kind of like a late game cleanup, if they, if you don't actually knock them out with Radicate Break. Um, that seems like the only thing I can really think of. Um, so maybe it'll have some use there, it's hard to say. But definitely a very pretty card, if nothing else. So we have three packs here. Let's start with a uh, good old Mega Gardevoir here. Okay, let's see. So here we have ourselves a Rufflet, a Litleo, Meryl, Ponyta, Dino, Claw Fossil, 
Duat, Braviary, Reverse Hollow Dino, and just a rare Bastiodon. So we've gotten two fossil Pokemon. That's kind of interesting, I guess. A shame they weren't better cards, but nevertheless, kind of interesting, I guess. Okay. But we still have, what, like five packs counting this one, so we still have some chances to get something good. Have another Litleo, Sneasel, Yanma, Apom, Clauncher, Duat, uh, the shiny Azumarill, the new dual type cards, Persian. Ooh, that's cool. Uh, Reverse Hollow Xernia. So, definitely a very playable card, actually. Um, we did a, I believe, a deck profile and battle with it on PTCGO recently with uh, Giratina EX and Xerneas Break. So, if you want to see this guy in action, definitely go check that out as well. And cool, a Hollow Eveltal. Uh, so, we got both the Kalos Legendaries, and both are actually playable cards. Eveltal has been like a staple of dark decks for what seems like forever. Um, and I think this actually might be my new favorite art of the card as well, so I'm definitely okay with those, even though they're not EX or, you know, like a break or anything like that. Alrighty. So here we have a Fletchling, Dot, Drifloon, Meryl, Shellos, Laffy, Drifblim, Pokemon Ranger, Reverse Hollow Qualitzer, okay, it's a, it's a decent card, has that ability Mega Boost, lets you attach a special energy from your hand to one of your Megas, so it's a, it's an okay card, and oh snap, we have ourselves a Full Art Magearna EX here, very nice looking, not one of my favorite cards from the set by any means, but definitely... I am perfectly okay with this out of a blister pack. So, definitely cool. Has that ability, Mystic Heart. You prevent all effects of your opponent's attacks, except damage done to each of your Pokemon that has any metal energy attached to it. So, seems interesting. I mean, Bronzong's rotated out of standard now, so I don't know the purpose of this card at this point. Maybe, I don't know, maybe decks that run rainbow energy or something could benefit from it. So, seems kind of cool. But yeah, definitely happy with that guy. Well, actually, I'm gonna have to move this in just a second, so. Alrighty. I'll just put our homeboy in Magearna back there with the rest of our promos. So here we have our Rayquaza blister pack. Hopefully this can at least match what we got out of the uh, Azelf one. I feel like no matter what, when you open these things, like when you go to peel the, the backing paper off, you can never get like, it always leaves this white residue. <laughs> All right, finally got into it there. So you belt all break pack, Xerneas break pack, and another you belt all break. So here we have our Rayquaza promo, kind of cool looking. Again, I don't think this card is particularly playable, but I don't know. So I don't know, Dragon Blast, let's check out that attack. 120 for a Fire, Lightning, and Double Colorless, discard a Fire and Lightning attached to him. So I don't know, you can discard just a Double Dragon energy with this if you want to. I don't know. It, it doesn't seem great, but who knows, maybe down the road it'll be good. So let's see. Come on, Full Art Sycamore. Or I should say, come on, not Steelix EX. <laughs> Alright, so here we have a Tangela, Clink, Joltik, Pawniard, Fungus, Nidorino, Special Charge, Clang, Reverse Hollow Volcarona, so that's kind of cool, it's a rare, and I really like the reverse pattern on these uh, dual types too, it, they managed to like, 
do the the grass pattern and the fire pattern but they cut them in half still that's kind of cool oh and another volcarona so <laughs> nothing crazy but still at least we got a rare reverse if nothing else Okay, so here we have an Oshawott, Rufflet, Tangela, Krogunk, Mareep, Skiploom, Halucha, Tangrowth, Reverse Hollow Hoppip, and a rare Yen Mega. So Yen Mega is actually a pretty solid card. Um, we've put out a couple of videos with this guy already, but definitely one of my more favorite Pokemon that have come out of this set for sure. Has that cool Sonic Vision ability, so if you have four cards in your hand, and Mega can attack for free, so it's definitely cool. Okay, guys, and we have one last pack here. I know we already got a full art EX, but hopefully we can get ourselves a decent break or another EX or something. Alrighty, moment of truth. So we have a Yanma, Apom, Larvesta, Drifloon, Ponyard, Persian, Greedy Dice, Monfernet. I just want to say for a second too, it's called Greedy Dice, but there's only one in the picture. It should probably be Greedy Die if, if I don't know, that seems like it makes more sense to me. <laughs> but anyway, so we have a Monferno. A Reverse Hollow Klefki, which is actually a pretty decent card. Um, I think this is a bit of an underrated Pokemon from Steam Siege, actually. So I'm okay with getting this. And just a rare Pyroar. So nothing too crazy out of the Rayquaza Blister Pack. But on the plus side, we did pull this very nice Full Art Magearna EX out of that uh, Azelf Blister Pack. So definitely... Definitely a cool looking card. And then of course we also have our promos that we got out of this as well. So we got our Lucario, Azelf, and Rayquaza. Definitely some cool looking cards, if nothing else. And like I said, maybe Azelf can be playable in Raticate Break one day, who knows. But anyways, um, I'm okay with that. We got a full art EX out of some blister packs. Can't go wrong with that. But yeah, guys, that's going to be it for this one. Um, as usual, feel free to like and subscribe. And don't forget to check out our merch over at RareCandyTCG.com, where we actually just stocked these awesome Pokemon Go themed playmats and some other out-of-stock items. But with that, I appreciate you watching, and we will see you guys for the next one, okay?